Goose. He knows he's wrong for this. Alright, here we go. Sandy, you know, he, he's really been excelling tonight by going for counter punching, finding openings, taking what he's given, not overstepping bounds. Captain Falcon isn't really that type of play, like character. Captain Falcon just kind of goes in, and if you're caught slacking at all, there's going to be a me or a set of Doc Martens waiting for you. And so far, that aggression has been getting punished by Sandy. Ice in his veins. They stay chill out there in San Diego. Like There's a shield. So the, the thought experiment of Captain Falcon not yet bearing fruit. Raptor boost. Uh, the other way. He finds it though. Still early on. Captain Falcon is one of the most explosive characters in the game, so no lead is guaranteed. Back there, down smash for the Falcon kick. Spice and trade. Back in Falcon two kick a lead. That actually paired. That up smash hitbox is a little suspect. Like, have one of these. Let's go for a ladder. Shoots and ladders out here. Oh, solid DI. 86 percent though. Sandy again enjoying the lead. Throws out the flood. Nico looking for the forward tip. That misses. A bit of patience waiting. I mean, he was charging that kick up. Oh, Sandy, Sandy almost caught another one. Nico's really for the home run swing. No singles or doubles out here. It's the Captain Falcon. Up and down, black, pull it up, pull it out. Sandy enjoys those, though. One of the faster smash attacks you're going to see out here. Ooh. He had the space on that just right because of that. If those in roll frames didn't last long enough, and that space is there. It's a hard pair of boots. There we go. Final spots. Game. Double move. Oh no! If if Nico had another stock, he was going for the that, that sure. All the same down here. Did he go for the ropes? Either way, plate broken up. All right, Sandy's looking for a ladder combination. He gets it. I think I might. There we go. There we go. Yo, who's the camera? Oh, the camera? Uh, I'm recording stuff for a video, so I have to do a time lapse. So like, I had to sit there, and I was like, okay, I gotta let it run for like at least half an hour. Uh, hopefully, this match won't feel like half an hour, and we're already halfway through the time. We just thought you were bored. You were into some wild stuff. No, 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 no our region would avoid fighting Mario. Little did our region know that we were carrying a Mario in a carpool. I mean, Trojan horse. Right? San <laughs> Sandy's like, it's been six months. I've blended in. They haven't noticed me. <laughs> they haven't noticed me. Yeah, yeah, that's the exact thing. Wait, Sandy doesn't normally play Mario? He does. He does. He does. Okay, Sandy, okay. Sandy's been playing Mario since, since Smash 4. He used to play Brawl as Marth. Gotcha. So he kind of has a little bit of history. His original title is no Tekka, but he said next month he's going to take it back to no Tekka, so. Edmund said that this, this is a bet of some sort? Uh, yes. He lost the bet, and he had to take the game to SD Sandy. I'll let you guys figure out what the SD stands for. Uh, hopefully it's not going to be the SD. San, San Diego? No. No. I'll, I'll keep it peachy for you guys. Let's just say that. I'll keep it peachy for you guys. 
Oh no. Okay, <laughs> game two. Game yeah. two. Nice lead here for SP Sandy. Yeah. Nice. Uh, Nico is definitely one of the things he loves about Falcon is he likes to pull a point on how oh. broken Falcon is. So he likes to abuse some of Falcon's like obvious options, things like E on Smash, uh, dash grab, opportunities like that. So he likes, like I said, dash grab there. So he likes to abuse a lot of like Falcon's bigger. What bigger is? Time man, Chad Falcon. People he's underrated in a lot of ways. Yeah. I mean, this up smash is ridiculously disjointed, so you have to really be careful and respect it. That was really good for Sandy to actually anticipate where they probably keep it in the land, yeah. so you get the up smash punished, but unfortunately just this time it there. Oh, no, no attack. Going there, looking to close out the stocks. Super jump, pumps in, not so much. About to kick through to the center stage. Back here in neutral. Yeah, he's looking for an opportunity to get in. I like it. He's running in with shield, but that's kind of like his SD Sandy note. He can either go for a fireball to pressure the shield and go for a grab, or anticipate he goes for running in with shield and go for a grab afterwards. Not gonna be it now. Oh, that was close. Really There's well, only one place Falcon really wants to land, right? Right. Now smash charges up, gets shielded. Ooh. That would have been too Dropping these shield. big boy knees. Yeah. Ooh. It's not the first time we've seen Sandy go come back with the wall jump B reversal. That was good. That was good. Hi. Mario does really live his hurt box out there when he goes for the up B. So stick like that second Falcon's a down tilt and actually contest with this. Down air. For the option, it's the grab for I've his trouble. I've never seen down throw up one though. That was that was nice. I have to give credit for the percent here. Think so. Sandy definitely holding his own. Chad Falcon. Yeah. Uh, Falcon is the. Uh, you look for a textbook. Falcon is the definition of Chad. Especially with the, once he gets it, man, it's the Chad energy oh, channeled yes. into one move. Fourth throw. Yeah. Oh, we went for down throw. What a nice mix-up, too, because typically you can go for fourth of the edge guard setup, but down throw left Sandy in a bit of a DI mix-up that was pretty much like yeah. Nico get all the stock all together. Down, down tilt's a legit death sentence against Mario. Actually. Yeah. Like, the art it sends Mario on as a forward smash. Nice, he has a little recovery. I would like to see Sandy try to stop Falcon with a back air, especially trying to hit him on the stage. That would be really good because Falcon's recovery plan is very linear, and of course, he's going to insurance for all the recovery plans. Oh, good tech. I like that. That was good because he went for down smash, trying to see if he was going to tech or no tech. Option cover, this red fireball falls in, it's in there afterwards. Nico trying to cover the return of the stage successfully, so down to the beat, and Sandy off to the side. Up oh, air. I'll let you air. know when you can play the game. Mm, that was so good because uh, oh, oh, that was really good. That was so, so on that platform with that pressure that Nico was able to apply. Nice. It was really good because what Sandy was afraid of was the up E, so he wasn't ready for the up smash. After the up smash, he didn't anticipate Nico to go off the platform and go for another opportunity. He felt only a grab or maybe go for an up air off yeah. the platform, so he never anticipated the knee whatsoever. That was really good for Nico. Mario going through the concussion protocol right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it needed a bag of the face <laughs> like that. That's a standing eight count at least. Most Oof. definitely. That needs so much damage yeah. too. I, I empathize with Mario in that moment. Like that zoom in. <laughs> I, I don't. I hate really Mario. <laughs> I, I hope this character that's like nerfed to when he's low to. That's just me, man. Don't let don't my hate. That, that's that's equivalent to the bat signal to the Dark Wizzies and Master Mario's world. They look up at the sky I hope like, oh. Dark Wizzy, if you're listening to this vlog, uh -oh, uh -oh. I hope they nerf your character. Bro. Uh -oh. I uh -oh. hope you cannot, your Mario gets a nerf. <laughs> I say let the plumber play. Yeah, for sure. Let, let, let him run through. Let him run through. Here we go, game three, even though. Chad out here looking for the up airs yet again. Good pair, good pair, Sandy, too. Put it what cost? <laughs> nice. Ooh. I like the use of that delayed back air. Trying to just make people going for an out of shield option or like dropping shield in general. Tricky stuff here. Down throw, follow up. Nico, it's not the first time he's looking for these down smashes. Yeah, he does it as kind of a mix up because usually some opponents will go for the scrubby option and go for a directional air dodge inward to try to avoid something else. <laughs> right. Throw. No flood. I would have loved to have seen the flood charge just to just to stop the Falcon's recovery. Still really good the fact that Sandy still has the stage. Nice and returning there to put Falcon off the stage. Oh, you hit him with the proton back. Oh, no. Clever ruse. Yeah, you can be upbeat, but uh, 
more cost, man. The stage is way up there, so good luck. We'll be seeing that. <laughs> that was good up smash too, because as I mentioned, up smash is a disjointed. It would be really good at challenge standing and going for the aerial farmer approach. And stuff in my Israel. We really could use of like what would be a it's not an anti-air, but it's pretty much an anti-air at this point. Because of the destroy and the range it has. Electric boogaloo down smash. I like that option for Miko. He went for the top of the to get off this advantage. I actually have a really good friend of time, but I like at this point, we see how Sandy's gonna do those talking kicks. And this advantage is always there to try to catch him. Yo, I, I, I love when Mario's land these raw forward airs. Ooh. Oh, there's oh. reverse knee. Reverse knee. Re Miko's Yo. smiling. You're a goon! You're Sa a villain! Sa You're a villain! <laughs> I'm honestly shocked Sandy can still play because his eyes rolled into the back of his head off. He uses yeah. like he rolled his eyes hard. That's why Nico goes his character. He wants some people playing Falcon is broken and people are just sleeping. Just put some effort in the character, I mean, man. That's what I tell people, look man, your character won't get far unless you put an effort and time. You can't the character do all the work for you. Yeah, Falcon, ever since he got that forward. Oh oh, oh that, nah, that was barely it, that was barely it. He clipped them, but it wasn't Spicy enough. Moment. Okay, I'm sorry. Um, if he got that off the side B, I would have, I would have kicked the stun out of my carpool. You know, most characters when they're ahead of stock are looking for extra credit. Captain Falcon actively looks for kills. Yeah. He, he never needed to turn in. Yes. Falls to, falls to the plan for the landing. Oh. Another, another one. There. Ooh. Nice. It's really tough for a lot of players to actually play against Falcon in this case because of its small size. It's a phone. Yeah. It literally allows Falcon to kind of like get you in this range, put you in those positions. Also, the static photo platform is pretty difficult for Mario Falcon. Uh, but Mario, honestly, in my opinion, he gets buffed by the meta because there's a lot of positives on the platforms. And that's what Mario definitely needs to win in this game as well. So Mario having like a, basically no terrible stages is what makes Mario such a good character. And in that same sense, like Falcon, if he has platforms to work with, it's really good, especially the platform in the middle, right, with Smash. It is able to actually reach the earth. Well, Mario has the quintessential nice backer. Yeah. Like, it's the Swiss Army. It is a sword, literally, that's what I tell you. That plumber, <laughs> that plumber's back here is a sword. You don't have to watch out for the get up. Back. Once again, he has to stop going for that. Yeah, yeah, he has to stop going for that. At this point, at this point, Sandy has already caught up to this uh, fucking kid from the ledge, so uh, it, we've, we've seen him punish it every time. And if he, missed, if he doesn't punish it, he misses the punish, right. so he's already ready for it. So do we, do we see Chad or do we see Shulk? Uh, my money is on... Oh, he... No, no. He... I was going to say, nope. It's the reason why is because we were in the car today, and me, and Nico, and... And Nacho, HLB, and Sandy were talking like, who should I go today? We were like naming characters. And he just told us, I'm either going to go Snake or I'm going to go Falcon. So I think he's sticking the fuck with Okay. Okay. But if it's Grand I mean, Finals. it's been doing work, so. Yeah. And if it's Grand Finals and he's like oh, pretty much on the W, he's going to switch this one because he wants to I mean, He wants to take us on the sport. Yeah. Then he's real. Drops in for neutral air. That's going to be a grab for neutral air. Up there to follow up. 41%. Let's keep going. He's trying to find his way in. Gets one back air off that missed dash attack. No follow up. Welcome back to neutral. Nico walks into the neutral air. By the way, back air. Uh oh. That was good. That was good. Sentiment and minute take solution. So I immediately turned over to that case. That Sandy knows the percent, so he really knows what to go for, especially off the back air. And most people, what they try to do is once they get hit out of back air tomorrow, they want to take that, especially if it goes into the range. Oh no, he wasn't oh, in the no. range. He wasn't in the range. Oh no. They might have to Oh, that was good. That was really, really good. I told you. Nico has to stop doing that. Nico with these down specials. Yeah, that Falcon King is cracked, and unfortunately, Nico has to be on a better plan. They, they feel ambitious. They feel ambitious. It's good though because it does put you at a disadvantage at times, especially if you cross over opponent's shield. But at the cost that Sandy has already read those, right. he's just pretty much playing into his hands. Back air. That's not the 
an everyday option. Our special gets Sandy back on. 30, 30, 40, 40, 40. Oh, that was a mix up. That was a mix up. The one two jab to the LD. At this point, Sandy was going to block for and then you're ready from the second jab. Yeah. You're kind of one two, no, actually, I just wanted to. Hurt. Yeah. He's got, he's got Sandy a little bit scared, man. You know, Sandy knows, man. Like, I'm about to punch my ticket to win his finals. I don't want to give Falcon any momentum at all. You do that, true Apparel, 107, just the back throw. Looking for the stock, go ahead and leave yet again. Nice. I like that drift back uh -oh. there. Uh oh. And there it is. Yeah. Ooh, a goal. That was a really good drift back there for Sandy, too, because he was able to actually avoid a lot of buckets. All right, now Nico's going to turn it up really good. Down from the mirror. Trying to get the lighting here. Uh oh. We're seeing Sandy start to pull ahead. Nico's is not so fast, Sonny. Here's an up air. Here's another air dot. That's going to get punched yeah. with the grab. Oh, no. I thought it could be much worse. <laughs> I was, like, once you did the air dodge, it was like, oh. Nico's really good at submitting his opponents like direct air dodges because he knows when they're here. No tech, that was a really scary situation. Sandy was one inch away from getting a jab reset. Yeah. Sandy's like, damn, I might have given too much credit there because if he stepped forward, that was an easy jab. Bro. Yeah, go across the back air. air. Really good on the cross. Bop. At this point in the game, Sandy's so used to holding shield, you might be anticipating getting grabbed from Nico, but you never anticipated the cross up, and he has to get used to it, especially from the ledge. Well, Nico's Captain Falcon hasn't really been doing much with the Falcon dive. We were talking about how he's going with it, and I'm wondering if he's keeping that in the back oh, pocket. This or is money, this is money. If he got Ooh. the LD. I think if he went for a down there, that was, that was good back air. air. That was good back air. And Nico tried to hit him with the lower hit of Nair, which actually would have sent Sandy forward for it. 